Okay guys, I'm back again today with the Chrome Air Shaker. Today's project is to uh, prepare some strontium nitrate for use to make some go-getters. And in order to prepare my strontium nitrate, I want to make sure that it is going to pass a 40 mesh screen before I start mixing it up with the other components to make the go-getters. So let's go right into it. I want to get my, uh, my one liter container here and I'm going to put my strontium nitrate in it. This strontium nitrate I picked up from Skylighter. And um, so we get that strontium nitrate. I'm going to put it in the one liter jar. I'm working with about a pound of material. And um, go ahead and put that right in this one liter cup. Get it all out of the bag. Let the dust settle down in there for just a sec. All right. Now you can see here that uh, one pound of strontium nitrate doesn't quite fill this halfway up. So if I wanted to work with two pounds here, I probably could very easily do that. You can see that this is a powder, but it also has some chunks down in there. You can even hear them when they roll around on the plastic. So I'm going to take my 40 mesh screen because that's the uh, size that I really want this material to, to, to at least be. I'm going to put that on and make sure it's tight. I'm going to take a, a 0.75 liter on the other side. You could use whatever size you really want. And in this case, you could even use a half liter. I'll make sure that's good and tight. I'm going to turn it over and shake it up. You can see right away that the nitrate's already starting to pass. So this strontium nitrate's in pretty good shape. You can see it dropping every time I shake it. But what you will find is when it's all said and done, I got a fair amount of this material. Still a little bit coming down through there. When I shake it lightly like that, I can see it. It's almost like a, a salt shaker. But that's probably about it. Now you can see how much of that material is actually chunky. So, what we could do with that, we could take that to our ball mill and mill it up, but then we got a dirty ball mill to clean. So, one of the things that I like to do, that a, a solution to that this problem and having that kind of, uh, I could either take this off and try to force that down through the screen with my hand. I don't really want to do that. So, what I will do is I'll take my 40 mesh and that side off. You can see, nice and chunky. All right. Then, I'm going to take just a couple, take my screen off. I'm going to get a handful of these, uh, these are three quarter inch ceramic media uh, that you would normally use in the mill. And I'm going to toss those in the jar right along with that chunky strontium nitrate. I'm going to put my screen back on, make sure it's tight. I'm going to turn that over on top of the, the other jar. Go ahead and tighten that down. And now, I'm going to do the shake here. You'll find an up and down motion and a swirling motion will act a lot like a mill. And if I turn it completely sideways like this and tumble it just a few times and then shake it through, even banging it, but swirling it like this on its side, you can look at the material and see that it's already starting to pulverize and turn into powder instead of uh, being those chunks. And every once in a while, I'll just keep doing this, and I can just rock that media right on top of the screen. See that 
right about now, I'm about 99% complete. So let me pop this off and I'll show you what we have left. There's my nitrate there. There's my 40 mesh screen. And then I'm going to just take this media out and set it on the screen so we can see how much is left. Now you can see I've only got just a couple little crumbs down in the bottom there, which uh, that's that that part. I just press that with my finger, and guess what? We got 40 mesh strontium nitrate. So now I've got my material ready to go. And I'm going to close it up in this jar, and I'm going to label it, and I've got it ready to go for later. And then here, I'm going to take my 40 mesh screen, my media, and my other jar. And I'm going to take that right over to the um, sink and clean it up. And uh, you can see I've got no mess on the table. So now I've got this strontium nitrate ready to go. So when I'm ready to use it, it's just the way I want it. That's the chrome air shaker. Once again, preparing strontium nitrate.